we need some festive Christmas fun. We're talking somewhere, about heroes we? as well today on the yes, programme, we are. aren't we? Yeah, yeah, you yeah. Know, people who've really made a difference over the last nine months or so. And Jay it? McCovin's done a lovely yeah. piece for us that we're going to play a bit later, which is celebrating some of Breakfast's Heroes of the Year. We've uh, had a few, haven't we've we? We've had a few heroes here this year. My goodness, where do we start in a piece? We start, I don't know. I, but, uh, here's good luck to Jane. We've had clap for, uh, for uh, carers. We've had all sorts of other ways of remembering our, our heroes. But look, at this is... I've never seen her this before, but this is the way uh, that this lady, uh, Mrs Drummer, her name is, uh, Sarah Drummer, she is building a cake to thank the NHS. <laughs> this cake is 30 stone in weight, contains 360,000 oh, calories, so I'm not quite sure what the NHS will think of that, but it'll yes. just be a small slice each. Uh, but what a remarkable thing. And this thing. is what it looks like, Santa. That's that Santa that... hugging uh, an NHS worker wearing a mask. Absolutely brilliant. It's like Bake Off plus, 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 isn't it? Amazing. Six foot tall. Oh, wonderful. And this is a, a wonderful story. And um, this is about t twins. Get this, these are twins born two years apart. How does that happen? Of course, it's because of IVF. Our parents, Karen and James Marks, used IVF and the two little ones, not so little one of them, are considered twins as they were from the same batch of embryos. They were conceived at the same time on the same day. Um, so there they are. I can't remember, I'm just trying to look they are. Cameron and Isabella. Isn't that so sweet? That's gorgeous. Happy Christmas to them and you all as well. Um...